Hello and welcome to another edition of LEA's Our Voice, a podcast designed to keep our person served, parents, guardians, and friends in the know. I'm your host, Mike Leon, and as always, we welcome your comments on this podcast and your input on what you'd like us to talk about in the future. Send those comments to podcasts at le-academy.org. On today's edition of LEA's Our Voice, we are going to talk about what has been called the granddaddy of them all, the Super Bowl. We will be welcoming our sports enthusiast individuals who will be lending their opinions and predictions regarding the outcome of Super Bowl 55. Remember the predictions that you hear on our show today. Who's going to be right? I'd like to welcome uh, the first of five of our fabulous LEA individuals to the show today, beginning with Brett. Brett, welcome. Thanks. Brett uh, is a longtime attendee of LEA Warren. Brett is an avid sports enthusiast, plays a lot of hockey, plays a lot of softball, and we'd like to welcome you. Uh, so with that said, Super Bowl 55 is Sunday. What makes the Super Bowl such an exciting event for you? Seeing, seeing all the players and coaches. Well, the coaches have a, definitely have yeah. a lot to do with the game. So you right. like you like to see the players from both sides, right? Right. right. Uh, the important position on a football team is what? Quarterback. Quarterback. We have 43-year-old Tom Brady, Brady. for Tampa and 25-year-old Patrick Mahomes, Mahomes for Kansas City. City. Who's the better quarterback? Hmm. I'd say Tom Brady. Do you think yeah, the 43-year-old yeah. be just because he's been to the Super Bowl so many times, times before? Yeah. But what do you think of Mahomes? He's got them <laughs> young legs. He's a rabbit. I know. Okay, even though you think Tom Brady's a better quarterback, that's fine. That's fine. So our Super Bowl contenders, last year's Super Bowl champs, were the Kansas City Chiefs Kansas City, yeah. and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Yeah. Let's cut to the chase. Even though you do like Tom Brady yeah. over Mahomes, right. who's going to win this year? I got Kansas City. Why do you think the team you picked is going to win? Because <clears throat> they got better offense, better, better defense, and also you got um, Pat Smith and Holmes. He always runs very, okay. very fast, and also he sees everybody open. <laughs> any, any wide receivers is open. Okay. But we're going to be keeping an eye on that. Yeah. We're going to be keeping an eye on Tom Brady. All right. And we're going to see what's going to prevail. Should be an yeah. exciting game. And, of course, there's always those Super Bowl commercials as right. well, too. So. Right. Uh, besides the game itself, Super Bowl Sunday, yeah, another yeah. thing that comes is food. Right. Food of all types. You name it, people serve it. What's your favorite Super Bowl food, Brett? Mm, probably the salt, salt. So, Sausages? The, sausage, the kielbasa, the, the kielbasa on a bun? The bun or something like that. Plus, what are, are the other types of snacks? <laughs> snacks. Chips and dip. Yep. All good stuff like that. You're <laughs> going to serve up a bunch of that. Well, we don't know yet. We, my mom's had to figure that out. Oh, I'm, <laughs> I'm sure she will. Last but not least, what do you predict the final score? First for Kansas City, then Tampa Bay is going to be. 37 to 20. 37 Kansas City. 20 Tampa Bay. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Tune into the game to find out who's going to be right. Brett predicts 37 to 20. Brett, thank you for yep. being here today. Thanks. Yep. I'd like to welcome guest number two of our uh, fabulous LEA individuals, Mr. Cody. <laughs> Cody, how are you? I know you love football. Yes. Unfortunately, I know that you're a Pittsburgh Steelers fan. Pittsburgh's not there this year. No. Okay. What? Uh, why? But you still like to watch the Super Bowl. Yeah. Why is it such an exciting event for you? Uh, because I watch football on, on TV. Um, because it's fun watching football. I like football. So, everything about it. Everything about it. Now, the important position on the football team is quarterback. No, Holmes. We have four. <laughs> We have 43-year-old Tom Brady for Tampa and 25-year-old Patrick Mahomes for Kansas City. Yeah. Who's the better quarterback? You said it. Mahomes. Why do you think he's the best? Because they have the best for the football for football for passes and 
uh, his defense, the offense, and defense. Okay. And now, do you think Tom Brady's just getting too old? Uh, Tom Brady too old. He'll be retired soon. The Super Bowl after the whatever Tom Brady win the uh, <laughs> um Tennessee win the Super Bowl. Gotcha. So our contenders, we have them. Last year's champs, the Kansas City Chiefs versus the Ten- Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Let's cut to the chase. Who's going to win this year, and why do you think they're going to win? Because Kansas City beat the good of the football team because uh, the passes the defense, the offense, and the defense. And you think Mahomes is a good passer? Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> he can pass it for the, his players. That's important. Huh. Now, besides the game itself, another fun thing about the Super Bowl is food. Huh. Food of all types. You name it, people serve it. What's your favorite Super Bowl uh, food? Ribs, Kansas City ribs. Kansas City ribs. He's making me hungry, guys. Now, last but not least, we have your score prediction for the game. You said Kansas City. Uh, 31. 31. Uh, the ten, buck. Bucks would be 21. He picks Kansas City 31 to 21 over the Bucks. That's our second pick for Kansas City. Mm. Cody, thank you so much for being here. You're welcome. And we're going to watch the Super Bowl Sunday so we see if your predictions come true and if you got a if the score is exactly the way you predicted. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Hi, we're back. I'd like to welcome our third guest, Sam, to our Super Bowl podcast. And, you know, exciting thing coming up Sunday, the granddaddy of them all. Why is the Super Bowl, Sam, such an exciting event for you? Um, I like the um, the eating and drinking and and halftime show. Eating, drinking, and halftime show. Not no mention of the game itself and the commercials. Yeah, those are always great. But that means you're watching the full thing. You're you're absorbing the whole the whole event, which right. is good to hear. Um, the important position on a football team is quarterback, right? Yeah. So we got 43-year-old Tom Brady, 25-year-old Patrick Mahomes for Kansas City. Who's the better quarterback? Um, Patrick? Yeah. Why do you think? Just because of age? You just think he's a better all-around athlete? Just because of age. Yeah. He's a good athlete, though, isn't he? Mm Mm-hmm. Now, why do you think he's better? Just because he's younger? Yeah. Now, have you watched him throughout the year so far to get there? You haven't been a big fan. Mm -hmm. Who are you? Are you a fan of our Detroit Lions, are you? No, at least you're honest. We're looking for a quarterback. I think we got one. Who do we get, Goff? Yeah, Goff. Okay. Anyway, so the Super Bowl contenders are the Chiefs and the Buccaneers. Let's cut to the chase. Who's going to win this year? Um, the Chiefs. The Chiefs are going to win. And why do you think they're going to win? Just the better team? They're better team. Okay, you want to say a little bit more about them? Um, I'm I'm not too big of a fan of um Kansas City, so I don't know much about them. Okay, are you not? What about Tampa Bay? You're not a big fan of Tampa Bay either. You'd rather see Kansas City win. Okay. Besides the game itself, another fun thing is the food. All kinds of food. You mentioned it. What is your favorite Super Bowl food? Um, uh, don't know. Oh, come on. There's got to be something you can think about. Um, I like, it could, uh, could be pizza, chicken, ribs, barbecue. Pizza. Yeah. That would be your favorite, a big, thick Detroit-style pizza? And ribs. And ribs. That's a good thing. Well, last but not least, predict the final score. Here we go. We've got Kansas City. How many points do you think they're going to score to win um, this game? I believe 30 to 20. 30 to 20? No, 38 to 20. 38 for Kansas City, 20 for Tampa Bay. Yep. So noted. All righty. So we've got it down there. We're going to see what happens. Folks, don't forget to tune in to the Super Bowl to see what happens. Sam, thank you very much. Okay. Hi, I'd like to welcome Reality now to our Super Bowl show. Uh, Reality, welcome. Welcome. Thank you for welcoming me. Uh, This is our big Super Bowl podcast, Super Bowl 55. Hard to believe that this game has been played for 55 years. This is the 55th year. What makes the Super Bowl such an exciting event for you? 
that it I like watching the quarterbacks play and I like to see them run all the way down the hall hallway all the way down. All the way down the field? All the way down the what field. What about passing? You like to see good passing? Yes, I do. Now, um you watch the Super Bowl every year? Yes, I do. What about the commercials? Mm, not very much. You don't watch the commercials? What about the halftime show with mm. the stars that they have? Yeah, I watch the halftime show. That's good. So you try to take in the whole event. Um, our important position on a football team, we discussed this, is quarterback. That's the most important because they run the team. Okay. We have 43-year-old Tom Brady, 25-year-old Patrick Mahomes. Who's the better quarterback, according to you? Tom Brady. Tom Brady. And what is that based on? Just because he's got more experience? More experience. And age? You think that he can pass as good as Mahomes? Yeah, I think so. Yeah? We're, we're definitely going to see. You know, they're both good quarterbacks. So, so Kansas City was there last year. Okay? Mm-hmm. So the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, they're going to try to take this Super Bowl championship away from them this year. Let's cut to the chase. Who's going to win this year? I think Kansas City. Another one for Kansas City. And and why do you think the team you picked is going to win? Because they're more stronger team that I've ever seen. A more stronger offensively and defensively? The offense and defensively. Now, it's kind of strange. You, you like Tom Brady as a quarterback, but he quarterbacks for Tampa Bay, but yet you pick Kansas City to win. Yes. Okay. Just because you just, you think they're overall stronger, you just like Tom Brady as an individual. Yes. Or you like older guys. <laughs> Besides the game itself, another fun thing about the Super Bowl is food. People like all kinds of food. They eat early in the day, late into the night. Uh, what's your favorite Super Bowl food? Chicken fingers. Uh, okay. And with chicken fingers, you got to have a good dip. What's, what flavor of dip with chicken fingers? Ranch. There you have it, folks. We add chicken fingers to our list of, let's see if I can remember what the others picked. We had uh, Cody pick Kansas City-style ribs. We had um, Brett pick kielbasa sausages. And we had Sam pick, what did Sam pick? Pizza. Got to have pizza, a man after your own heart, Derek. (laughs) And so now we have the chicken fingers. We'll see what's going to happen. Listen. Last but not least, predict the final score. You told it to me earlier. Kansas City, how many? You said 44. 44. And what about the Bucks? 21. 44 to 21. I mean, that's that's better than half. So you're predicting Kansas City to really spank yes, I Tampa do. Bay. <laughs> well, I hope you're right. Folks, remember that score. Reality, thank you for being on the show. And thank you. Take care. You too. Hello. I'd like to welcome our next guest to our LEA podcast regarding the Super Bowl 55, and that is Lisa. Lisa, welcome to the show. Thank you, Mike. So good to see you. Glad to have you here. Hey, this Sunday, the granddaddy of them all, Super Bowl 55. They've been doing it for 55 years. What makes it an exciting event for you? It's fun to watch, and Tom Brady's on it. Okay. You said something earlier, too, though, besides the football in it, what do you like to watch? The halftime. The halftime show. And who is our halftime guest this this year? The weekend. One of my favorites. <laughs> and I'm laughing because I don't know who the weekend is, but you guys seem to know. I'm behind the times. Anyway, so the important position on a football team is the quarterback. The quarterback. Okay, we have forty three year old Tom Brady, twenty five year old Patrick Mahomes. Who's the better quarterback? Tom Brady. And why is that? It's kind of cute. Oh, cuteness wins football games. I've heard that before. That's why Matthew Stafford had to leave Detroit, because I guess he wasn't cute enough. Yeah. But anyway, because I remember you, you're usually a pretty much a baseball fan, but I think you like football because of Tom Brady. Now, he's been, he's been to the Super Bowl many times before. Do you think his experience is the reason you like him, too, besides being cute? Yeah. Okay. You expect to see him do a lot of passing or a lot of running? Passing and running. Oh, both. Okay, we're going to see. See if them 43-year-old legs can carry him. So our contenders are last year's champs, the Kansas City Chiefs and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, okay? 
Let's cut to the chase. Who's going to win this year? Tampa Bay is going to win this year. Okay. Uh, you are our first one out of all our guests that went with Tampa Bay, but that's good. And you just think that you picked them? You think they're just the better team because of your boyfriend, Tom Brady? <laughs> huh? Mm. You just think they're the better team overall? They're a better team. Okay. We're going to see what happens. We're going to have you put your score down in a minute. Besides the game itself, another fun thing about Super Bowl is the food. You can cook it and eat it all day. What's your favorite Super Bowl food? Pizza. Pizza. Another one for pizza. What kind? With everything on it? All types of pizza? What's your favorite type of pizza? Ham and... Sausage? No. Pepper, just ham? Pepperoni. Pepperoni. I love it. That's a good choice. Anything else? And pineapple. Okay, so you like the Hawaiian-style pizza. Beautiful. Okay, last but not least, you predict the score. Okay, you pick Tampa Bay as the winner. How many points do you think Tampa Bay is going to score? Probably 28 to 10. That's a good score. So there you have it. Our only one picking Tampa Bay this year. Everybody else picked Kansas City. Lisa picks Tampa Bay to win 28 to 10. Isn't that what she said? 28 to 10. I like that. It's different. And thank you for being on our show. You're welcome. Take care. Yep. Well, there you have it. Our sports experts have spoken. How will things turn out? We will have to wait and see, but... What a fun wait it'll be. Hope you enjoyed the Super Bowl 55 podcast. Watch the Super Bowl. Enjoy the Super Bowl. Watch everything. Have good food. Eat lots. And until next time, take care. Thank you.